Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Alright guys, so like a few months ago I had made uh, my balsamic vinaigrette pasta salad and today I'm actually following that up by making my Greek pasta salad for you guys. So without further ado, please hit the subscribe button down below and let's get into our ingredients. So for our ingredients today we have the Great Value Rotini. Um, I love the shape when it comes to pasta just because it really does help like soak up the dressing and everything. Um, and then we also have some black olives here that are pre-cut. We have some pre-cut cherry tomatoes, some pre-cut cucumbers, and then we also have some pre-cut red onions because we all know how I feel about red onions or just onions in general. Um, and then we also have, guys, this took me forever to find, the Follow Your Heart Dairy-Free Feta Crumbles. I'm honestly so happy that I found this. I found this at Sprouts. Um, if you guys can't find it in your local area, I would try maybe like one of the vegan websites. If not, then check your local Sprouts. Um, but yeah, so the first thing today that we're actually going to start out with is our pasta. I already have my water going, so I'm just going to open her up and toss it in. Guys, before starting today, I already had our water boiled and ready to go, so I'm just going to dump in the whole box. Boom, and I'm just gonna let that cook off for about like eight to 10 minutes, you know, till it's the perfect al dente. But in the meantime, I'm gonna start putting all of our veggies into the bowl. All right guys, so our first veggie that's gonna go in our bowl is gonna be our cucumbers. Drop the whole thing in. And then next we're gonna go in with our tomatoes. Then our black olives. Onions. And then, you know, you can't forget the whole, the fed. I'm gonna put pretty much like three quarters of it in. Just like a little bit more. Boom. Okay, so now that our base is all done, I'm actually gonna um, just come grab you guys once our pasta is done boiling and it's all strained out. And you guys won't be able to believe what I found for our Greek dressing today. It's honestly such a good hidden gem that's honestly really available everywhere. So as promised, I just strained and drained out my pasta. And a quick like little tip that I always do is you always wanna run your pasta under like extremely cold water. Just because the colder it is, the faster you get to eat it. <laughs> so um, ugh, without further ado, let me take you guys over to our dressing. So this dressing, I've literally seen it and found it everywhere throughout like the entire country. You find this at Dillon's, you find it at Walmart, you find it at Target, you find it at Stop and Shop Shaw's for my East Coast people. You find that Market Basket. You can literally find this anywhere. Um, so yeah, this is a great little vegan staple. If you guys haven't tried it, I definitely recommend it. And you know my rule, always get two just in case because it's better to have too much than too little. So before I add in my dressing, I'm actually just going to add in some pepper. Got to put in a good amount since it is quite a bit of pasta salad. And then we're going to go over with salt, pretty much the same amount. And then, of course, you can't forget Flavor God garlic lovers. Flavor God, if you're listening, send your girl a few boxes of this stuff. I honestly go through it like nothing. And then, keep our dressing a good shake again. Just gonna go through the whole bottle. And then, so before adding in the second bottle, I'm just gonna give this a nice good toss. Yeah, it honestly could use a little bit more. Nothing's worse than a dry pasta salad. 
let's be real. Yeah, let's say about like half the bottle's good. So like one and a half bottle will go a long way. And then if you ever want to make yourself a mini one during the week, it'll be even better. Even though if it's just you or your like spouse, this will literally last you an entire week. All right, guys, that's all I have for you guys today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed my take on a Greek pasta salad. I know you guys really love my balsamic pasta salad. Um, and if you guys tried it out yourself, please give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.